To join objects, this can easily be achieved by selecting the objects that you would like to join and then use the shortcut Ctrl J. But to unjoin objects, this becomes more complex based on what you are attempting to unjoin as there is three different options to choose from. The options are to separate the geometry by selection, by loose parts, or by material. To get these options to unjoin the object, go into edit mode and use the shortcut P. Selection works by separating based off the geometry that is currently selected. Loose parts works by unjoining every object that is not connected physically by geometry. And material works by separating the geometry based off the material that has been assigned to the different parts of the geometry. So with these options, it can get very confusing of how to use them effectively and when each one should be used. But don't worry, I'll break it down further. When there are two objects that are joined, you can separate them by using the shortcut A to select all the geometry and then use the shortcut P and select by loose parts. But say you have three objects joined and you did this, it would separate each one into their own object. So if you only wanted one of them to separate, you have to change the type of separation you pick and the geometry you select. If you hover over the object and use the shortcut L, it will select the object as long as it is not broken up by islands. Islands is when the seam lines break up the object. Otherwise, you may need to do this over each island until it's fully selected. Then use the shortcut P and select by selection. Now, if an object has two materials applied to it, like before, you can use the shortcut A to select all the geometry and then use the shortcut P and select by material. But once there is more materials assigned to the object and you want to separate one material from all of them, you will have to go into the material tab, highlight the material and then pick the button select, which will highlight the correct geometry. Then using the shortcut P, then picking by selection. Consider subscribing and liking to help me make more of this type of content and good luck on your project.